the European Union unveiled a 750 billion euro recovery package on Wednesday. Every member state will get grants and loans to help them bounce back from this year's economic downturn. Another aim is to protect the EU's single market from being split by varying economic growth and wealth levels. That, as the bloc is expected to emerge from its deepest ever recession this year. EU Commission President Ursula von der Leyen. The Commission is today proposing a new recovery instrument called Next Generation EU, worth 750 billion euro. It will sit on top of a revamped long-term EU budget of 1.1 trillion. We'll harvest Two thirds of the 750 billion euros would be in grants financed by joint borrowing and one third in loans. But the grants are controversial. States, including Denmark and Austria, would rather see low interest loans paid out to lower income countries. The Commission says grants are better because Italy, Spain, Greece, France and Portugal already have high debts and are heavily reliant on tourism that was brought to a halt by the pandemic. They will find it harder than more frugal northern nations to restart their economies through borrowing. These are Tushas, these are grants. These grants are a joint investment in our future. They have nothing to do with the debts of the member states in the past. The grants go through the European budget, and the budget limits the payment of each country according to a fixed scale. All 27 EU member states must support the package for it to go through. Big hitters France and Germany both back the plan.